Hey guys, it's Gina Militia from GinaMilitia.com and today I want to show you how to bring life into the eyes of your portraits using Lightroom. So on the screen now I've got an image that I shot recently in Cuba and I like everything about the image. There's lots of detail going on um, in the beard, lots, lots of richness in the shot. And basically here's the before shot and here is just some minor adjustments that I've done to bring out the texture, particularly in the beard and uh, in the skin tone. So basically what I've done is just opened up the exposure a little bit. I've dropped the highlights, opened up the shadows to bring in um, uh, like lift the, the the tones there in the middle there and also added some black a little bit of clarity drop the saturation and some vibrance so everything I'm pretty happy with how it's looking overall the only issue I have is that there isn't a good catch light in the eyes now I could have changed this if I had have had time I could have popped a reflector uh, into the shot and perhaps uh, reflected some light back into the eyes and that would have given a nice catch light. I could have used some fill flash or I could have uh, maneuvered my model so that I had uh, a light background. Often it's a window or something light colored behind me that would have reflected into the eyes and given a nice catch light. I don't have that. So the, the, the eyes look a little dead. They look soulless to me. So what I'm going to do is use the adjustment brush and that's in the develop module. It's uh, this, this little icon here. The shortcut is K. So bring that up. You get a drop down menu. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a brush, give it a little bit of a feather and make sure that the brush is about the size that it'll fit um, just around the iris there of the eyes and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to lift my exposure a little bit and what I like to do is I like to keep my flow around 50 and I'll bring the density up so that you can see what I'm doing really quickly and what I'm going to do all right so we've zoomed in on the eyes and what I'm going to do now is just and I'll bring up the shadows as well is I'm just going to bring out some more detail there in the eyes so I'm just going to bring out the the brown tones in the eye and what you can see happening is there are little flecks there are highlights there I just didn't manage to get them with the exposure that I shot at so what I want to do is really bring out these little flecks of white which are actually uh, catch lights that weren't exposed properly so I've done one sweep there with the brush so you can see there the before and after and that's added some some tone in the eye so the eyes are actually a brown tone but because of the way I exposed the shot you, you're not seeing that tone I can also add a little bit of warmth here just by uh, adjusting my temperature slider and what I'm going to do now is that's my just adjusting the iris there and now I just want to add uh, enhance these little flecks of white that I can just see there with a new brush and I'm going to just tackle the whites and the highlights now so I'll get rid of the shadows and I'll just drop the exposure back and I'm going to come in and just go over those areas there where you see those little white flecks and that's hopefully just going to bring out the little spots and the the uh, the highlights in the eyes a little bit more and I can let's see if what, what happens if I just increase my exposure a little bit more up the whites and up the highlights so it's just telling Lightroom to just focus on the highlight areas of that particular spot there so you can see now that there is a bit more life so if you see before and after you can see that that's starting to look a bit better now the bit that's concerning me is probably this area here and over here is possibly a little bit uh, too too bright so what I'll do is if I come back and hover over uh, this uh, toggle here I can come back to that area and just drop the exposure down a little bit 
All right, so let's have a look now. We can see before and after. And if I zoom out, and I'll just hide those areas, we can see that now there is a lot more life in the eyes and in fact one thing I'll do is I'm just going to bring in a new brush I can see that the uh, left eye um, of the person is a little bit brighter than his right eye so camera le camera left is darker than camera right so what I'm going to do is just with a new brush just come in and just brighten that up overall so that they both match so we can see now before and after and I think that overall that's looking a lot better you can see a little sparkle and uh, just picking up the catch lights that weren't there but that in the shot but um, are definitely there now once we've tweaked the shot a bit